My name is Christos. I'm the owner of Helen's Lachonet on Hope Street, 320 Hope Street, for almost 28 years. And today I like to make one of my specialty stuffed red peppers, Greek style, with uh, orzo and stir rice. A cup of onions, Arab oil, two tablespoons of Arab oil. I like to saute the onions a little bit, couple minutes, three. some uh, garlic, fresh garlic, probably five pieces. Give the, the garlic give more of a flavor of food. And now I'm gonna put the, the ground beef. Probably five pounds of, uh, <clears throat> of uh, ground beef for uh, eight peppers. I'm gonna cook the, the beef a little bit with the onions and the garlic. And then put three quarters of uh, a pound orzo. I like the Greek orzo because uh, it stays more firm. I use tomato sauce. I do my own tomato sauce. I make it this morning. And I put a little bit of tomato sauce. Cook it together. Pepper. I prefer kosher salt or sea salt to give more flavor. Parsley. Oregano and fresh basil, sweet basil. Cook it together, all together. Slow down this a little bit. And I'm gonna do the peppers now. I've washed the peppers before. It's ready to go. I'm gonna put in the peppers like that. I like it like this way. Some people they use it upside down, but that's okay too. The reason I like it this way, after I finish with the peppers, I'm gonna drop a little bit of olive oil at the top before I put it in the oven. Cover it with aluminum, aluminum foil. I like to prepare the peppers and put it back to the refrigeration for a couple hours, three, or sometimes even overnight. They have, they give them better flavor because the, the spice and the, all together, they work together, they give better flavor. That's, I, I believe that. Out from the fridge after two hours plus and I put it in the oven. To the oven, 375 degrees for an hour and 40 minutes. I like to put a little bit feta cheese on the top like that. A little bit tomato sauce. And mashed potato on the side? And Usually, yes, mashed potato and 
mashed potato with gravy, brown gravy, and uh, and vegetables. And this is the finished product. I said thank you for your time.